Really? You, 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 cause you forgot who the fuck You ain't know your girl had a little skills in her back pocket, just in the back one though. One pocket, the one. Do it, do it, do it, do it, baby. What's up, everybody? It's your girl, Lyric Locked Up, bring you fresh shot content all day. Yeah, hi! Guess what? Your girl looking a little fleeky or whatever. Yeah, look at you. Mm, looking sexy and stuff. So, this is my first makeup tutorial on this little pizzy right here on the Lyrically Locked Up channel. I hope you guys like it. I'm going to hit you with some funnies on the voiceover. This is what we popping with. You know, you got to keep it sexy even when you got to start a locks in your hair. But this is an everyday look that I wear. So people don't call me sir. Because I was getting real tired of it. So, if you want to get fleek, if you want to look cute, and if you want to impress somebody with these little things in your hair, Watch the video. I love you guys. Don't forget to subscribe at the end of the video. You're going to press that sexy face with that makeup that I did. Fleet though. Okay. Your girl got skills. If you want to get some makeup, hit me up. Press that button. And say, hey, girl. Hey, girl, sister. I got you. Or if you a boy, I can hook you up too. I got some stuff for you too, bro. All right. I love you guys. Share, comment, subscribe. Do whatever you like. Don't press the dislike button. But I know you won't because you love this. And I will see you next time. And we go to get it right now. All right. So I'm going to use this moisturizer that this lady from Sephora. Sephora. What the world? From Sephora. I can't talk. From Sephora put me on. And, you know, it's supposed to make my face dewy but I don't like doing this so I don't know why I bought it but um it yeah I put it on for moisture and yeah I like it so uh huh um and I'm gonna do my brows and this piece of hair that is pissing me off um, I'm gonna play with that and I brush my brows we're gonna do the brows and the trick to doing brows is like kindergarten um you just put a whole bunch of shapes on your face and try to draw in between the lines and color but the hard part is it's not like kindergarten it's more like geometry and it takes about two years of practice before you actually master them so this is my t two years of mastering eyebrows for me to understand how these puppies work and my eyebrows are more like best friends and not sisters Oh, yeah, here we go. He said, well, let's color in these babies and color in between these lines and shade, baby, shade. Let's go. I'm going to shut up now. Let's go. Now, I know somebody out there in the makeup world is going to cringe and scream. Oh, my God. She's in black on her eyebrows. <laughs> don't, don't, don't kill me in the comments. Black is okay. 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 It's okay. I know. But the black is going to blend and it's going to make my eyebrows snatch. And you're going to be like, yes, girl. I need to use black. You're going to run to the... You're going to run to your counter. To your county. To your nearest CVS and be like... Can I get some black eyeshadow right now? It's for my eyebrows. I, I promise you, y'all gonna 
be so on this okay so right now after I did the black I'm gonna clean it up with my MAC concealer don't ask me what shade it is if you want to know and y'all really want me to post up some makeup tutorials um, <laughs> be like girl put all the stuff in the description box I will put you on to all of the products in the description box if y'all really don't like it then just be like find a new hobby okay I got you all right honey boo boo yeah it's all right by the way I only put the black on the tips <laughs> get it no for real I only put the black on the tips don't put the black all the way over your eyebrow don't look like Elvira I only put it on the tips and then I put um foundation on the top of the brow so my eyebrows are not floating Okay, and then I'm going to use a fluffy brush and I'm going to blend out everything because we don't want floating brows that is not popping in 2017 or 16 or 15 or 1997. All right, so we're going to blend everything out. And yes, I'm going to stop talking again, like I said before. All right. A good trick for women, men, Anybody that has oily lids, I take a setting powder and before I put my eye, eyeshadow on, I press that into my eyelids, especially my creases, and I do that before I even put on eyeshadow and it soaks up the oil so that my eyeshadow doesn't crease. That's just a trick for anybody out there that has oily lids, like myself. Okay, so what I'm doing right now is I take the best shade in the... The Chocolate Bar 2 Palette by Too Faced. I wish I had all the colors in front of me right now, guys. I'm so sorry. I'm, like, so terrible at this. Um, that is the Peanut Butter Shade, and I'm putting that into my crease. And I'm looking around for whatever. I don't know. And I'm using a fluffy brush, and I'm putting that into my crease. And then I'm using, if you just don't have this palette, then I'm just going to tell you what I'm using. So I use a color that's all reddish brown color and I'm putting that into my crease. And then right now I took a darker brown, about two shades darker. Then I put that into my crease and now I'm taking a color that's about four shades darker and I'm putting that into the outer third of my eye. And this is all just to deepen my crease. I'm building up my crease. Oh, gosh. Let's not beat up the microphone. <laughs> Girl, are you mad? <laughs> now I'm going to take um, the golden shade of the palette and I'm going to press that onto my lid. Now, this is to highlight my lid and bring out all of them beautiful eyelids. Girl, yes, honey. Okay, and then we're going to do it on the other leg because we can't be lopsided. Mm -mm, that is not popping either. Just like them floating eyebrows. After our little turn up break then I took the black of the palette and I'm just going right over that darker shade that I put and I'm putting that onto the outer V of my eye and darkening that even more um, just to give the look some more depth and I'm taking a fluffier brush that I haven't used and I'm breaking the brush <laughs> and I'm like okay well brush and I guess the brush ain't phased me because, you know, we're going to get a little bit more turn. And, <laughs> yeah, the brush ain't phased us. No, girl. Um, then we're going to blend it out. And then I'm going to take a new brush and I'm going to highlight the brow. <laughs> no floats here. And blend that out. And the eyes are done. And now we're going to go to the face. And I'm gonna, this I've had for years. It's by Maybelline. Oh, no, it's not, girl. It's Maybelline. No, it's not. It's by L'Oreal. And it's actually um, an age rewinder concealer. I love it. I put it underneath my foundation. And I'm just using water to wet my beauty blender, and I'm gonna blend that out. And that's just gonna serve as a highlight underneath my foundation, but it's also good for my under eyes and. 
just helps me keep me young. Not that I have to worry about that, but you know, we want to prevent that before it's a problem later. So yes, and I'm going to blend that out and I'm going to put my foundation right over top of that. And the foundation that I'm using is, I don't know, <laughs> but it's by Black Radiance. Um, and I believe the color is uh, Rum Raisin. Yes, that's the color I'm using, Rum Raisin by Black Radiance. And I'm going to blend that in with a flat foundation brush. And I'm going to dance a little bit because this is all exciting. Makeup is exciting, everybody. Yes, turn up for the makeup god. And blend that in and don't rub away your eyebrows because you work so hard on that geometry. Then I'm going to use my concealer and this is from NYX. I'm going to warm that up on the back of my hand and I'm going to place that under my under eyes. And we're going to highlight some more because you can't highlight enough. You want to gleam. Gleam for them. Shining. Shining, 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 yeah. That's what Beyonce said. All of this winning. <laughs> I don't even like that song. But it was perfect for that. But yeah, so then I'm going to blend that out because we can't go out here unblended. I don't know if that made sense. But yes, make sure you blend it all out. And nice and even and smooth. You want to look seamless. That's the word I was looking for. Seamless blending. Yeah, and then you're gonna reverse contour, dance a little bit, or make sure you get that mustache. Yeah, cover that on up too. Yeah, you need to cover that stash. Everybody got one, even if you think you don't. Yes, make sure you get all the way up to the hairline. Okay, now it's time for the contour. Like my best friend would say, the contour. Okay, do the little fish face. That's not really even necessary. Okay, and make sure when you hit your contour, you, you go up, not down. Don't make the long extra landing pads on your face. You're going to blend up into your cheekbones so it can be nice and snatched. Yes, make that face look like you have having eight in five days. You want it nice and snatched, okay. And then we're just going to skip over that like we never even did it. <laughs> And go to the eyes, okay? We just didn't even contour, okay? We'll skip that. And all right, and we're gonna stick this thing all up in our eyes and go to the mascara. And I just put on a bunch of mascara. I don't like lashes that much unless I'm taking pictures. But I just put on like 50 coats of mascara. Just go hamburgers and cheese with the mascara. And I put it on the bottom lashes too, or you look like you put foundation on your bottom lashes and you look surprised <laughs> all the time. I'm laughing at myself, but now y'all see here what it's like when I record my own videos. I be going hamburger and cheese laughing at myself. I don't even know what the hamburger and cheese came from. I must be hungry. But that color that I'm using on my cheeks, the, um, ugh, the blush is burnt copper love it from mac it is the bomb get you some and yeah where i used i don't know what that color is but it's some type of lipstick and it's matte and i put a little bit of it on and i rubbed it in and i'm gonna use this thing from remember sephora no from sephora and i'm gonna rub it in smear it and I'm gonna put some gloss on top you can do whatever you want with your lipstick it don't even matter I don't even really wear lipstick cuz I eat so much it just rub off anyway <laughs> who's that person that you know when you eat something you rub it or you wipe it off before you even eat cuz you know you gonna get it on whatever you eat oh just me fat girl problems okay never mind. and then you know uh, I kind of did this backwards but you know I was supposed to kind of put um my setting powder on first but it's about it's from makeup forever but i meant to put that on um for, <laughs> before i put on all the blush and stuff but you know i was kind of rushing and uh, i did backwards but yeah i'm done i hope you guys like it. but it's been two months since your girl got the locks in her hair Yeah. I'm not fucking yeah.
Yeah. <laughs> 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 <laughs>